Hey everyone, what's up? This is Marcos with CJ Studio University. Welcome to another notes video. And in this note, I want to show you how to enable library support in WebStorm. I mean, if you're working with Node.js and WebStorm, you're usually seeing these little underlining require statements. And it's because WebStorm actually knows of Node.js, but it doesn't support it by default and you need to activate it within the settings. Go to the WebStorm setting by using the command comma shortcut or you can go by WebStorm preferences as well. Okay, and then go for library support, which is over here. Okay, and then you can activate the Node.js core libraries. And let's mark the checkbox, apply it. And in the background, you might see it already updating. No, sorry. Okay, now WebStorm picked it up. You can see that WebStorm is now highlighting the require statements and all the, the Node.js specific statements that are usually not highlighted or underlined that it isn't supported in WebStorm or it's an unknown function, whatever. So let's go back to the settings. It's under languages and frameworks, JavaScript libraries, and then you can activate the highlighting or the library support for Node.js and HTML. And if you want to activate the library support for any other framework or library in your node modules folder, you can add it over here like this one. And then you just need to go like attaching directories or files and navigate through the configuration. Okay, so we hope you like it, activate it to get syntax highlighting, enjoy coding and Make it rock.